Shalom. All praise is due to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Racha Kwadash. Double honor to the elect apostle, others a great millstone at Ruel. Shalom to the elect Akiah, did his work to serve the in truth and not for vain glory in season out of season. Abaratiza, I uh, just want to bring out these two scriptures. Okay. Um, one scripture, the um, Yahweh Shai said himself to uh, Satan when he was being tempted, okay, by Satan, all right? And, you know, the churches read this scripture, you know, but they don't live by it, you know? But we, that of the hopeful elect, um, we live by this, or we should live by this. And a good example is the uh, apostles uh, of Great Millstone. Okay, and elders of Great Millstone. Okay, the apostles being our greatest example in its truth. Okay, which is that we are the Israelites, you so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans are the Israelites that the Bible speaks of. Okay, that the so called black man is the real Jews that the Bible speaks of. Okay, that was brought over here in cargo slave ships. All right, and that you West Indians and Haitians. You are Israelites, you so-called uh, Latinos and Native Americans, you're Israelites of the Bible. But uh, I remember the Apostle Tahar uh, made a statement that this truth is a way of life. Okay, so I'm going to just read the scripture that our Lord, Yahweh Shai, the Deliverer, said to the spiritual demon Satan. You know, which we should say to the spiritual demon Satan too. You know, when he puts them thoughts in our mind, man. Okay. Like, like the scriptures say, for we wrestle not against flesh and blood, you know, but principalities, you know. So we wrestle against these 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 demons, man, okay, on the left-hand side. All right, so let me uh, go right to it. It says, this is Matthew 4 and 4. No, I read 3. And when the tempter, which was Satan, came to him, to Yahweh Shai, he said... If thou, if, if thou be the son of Yahweh, command that these stones be made bread. But he answered and said, It is written, man shall not live by bread alone, but by every word that proceedeth out of the mouth of the, the Most High, Yahweh. Okay, and you know, it seems like a basic scripture, but it says a lot. You know, you know, you need bread to sustain you, you know, you need food so that you can live. Okay, but but he answered and said, It is written where in the Bible, man shall not live by bread alone. You know, so we're not here just to um, eat, okay, to sustain us, okay? We are here to live by every word of Yahweh, okay? All right? That means what? A way of life, okay? All right? What's our way of life? going out on the highways and byways okay all right going out to speak on the streets in the cities okay what's our way of life rehearsing the righteous acts which are the Lord's statutes and commandments okay all right what's our way of life praying to Yahweh Bahashem Yahweh Bahashem Yahweh Shai in faith, nothing wavering, okay? What's our way of life? Studying to show ourselves approved, studying these scriptures, okay? All right, being in the mindset of every word of Yahweh, the Most High, okay? You know, so this is supposed to be a way of life for us, okay? Those that are in the know, okay? For the hopeful elect, those that know the truth of the word of 
Yahweh, which is the Mosai, and Yahweh Jai, which is the deliverer, the Mosai's son. Okay? So, you know, the, the churches read it, but they don't follow it. You know? You know? They don't want to deal with the law, statutes, and commandments, which is not eating pork, shrimp, crab, and lobster. Okay? Not uh, shaving your head bald. Not cutting off your beard. Not uh, lining up your beard and your uh, hairline. Okay? All right? You know, they say the laws are done away with. You know? All right? They don't rehearse the righteous acts, which are the law, statutes, and commandments. You know? They do whatever they want to do and say God is all love. All right? You know? They pray to uh, Caesar Bogius, whom the uh, image that the so-called white man spread through deceived the earth all right of that image of the lord being a so-called white man okay so you know it seems it's a basic scripture but it says a lot man you know so this truth must be a way of life for those of us that know our nationality that we're israelites according to the bible all right that we know the name of the Most High and the Son. Yahweh is the Most High's name. Yahweh Shai is his son's name. All right? But he answered and said, at, but he answered and said, it is written, man shall not live by bread alone, but by every word that proceedeth out of the mouth of Yahweh. Yahweh. Okay? You know? So, that's what it is, man. You know? And what's the word of Yahweh? To go out here on the highways and byways and, and teach this word, man. Go into the prophecies. Because the word of the Mosai, Yahweh, Yahweh Shai, is prophecy. Okay? All right? So this is a way of life. Okay? Put up the shows. You know? Not for vain glory. You know, not to be a, a, a YouTube star, but to what? Feed the flock, feed the sheep. Okay. Well, who are the sheep? The sheep are who? The elect of you so-called Nicos, Latinos, and Native Americans. Okay. You're the sheep of Yahweh Bahashem Yahweh Shai. All right. So, uh. Let's go to um, let's go to Proverbs one and twenty. Proverbs one and twenty. All right, but this is our job, man. This is our way of life. Okay. One and twenty. Okay. Proverbs 1 and 20. Wisdom crieth without. Okay. So, you know, you have certain individuals that don't want to go out on the highways and byways and teach. Okay. When Yahweh Shai went out and taught, man, he just didn't teach in the synagogues. Okay. He went amongst the people and taught the people, man. Okay. All right. Which are you uh, so-called Negroes? Okay. West Indians and Haitians, man. All right. And then he, and then, he's, then he said, I have other sheep of this fold, you know, which is the other tribes, which is the northern kingdom. All right. So it says, wisdom crieth without. So wisdom crieth without, man. You know, you can't just... Just be in a school and do shows in a school and then not go out. Wisdom cry without. Wisdom is the truth. A cry without. So you got to go out and teach. Okay? You got to go out and teach, man. All right? You're supposed to go out and teach on the highways and byways. All right? Wisdom cry without. She uttereth her voice in the streets. Okay? The her represents wisdom. Which is this truth. You know? Where do we have to be at? In the streets. 
Okay, we have to be seen in the streets, just like how the scriptures say. All right? We have to be seen, man. All right? What the scriptures say? That I shall see thy teachers. That's right. Wisdom crieth without. She uttereth her voice in the streets. She crieth in the chief place of concourse. Yeah. You know? And that's where the majority of brothers speak. They, they speak in the chief concourse. You know? Where everybody walks through. Where everybody goes through. You know? They go in the cities. You know? And they teach in the cities, man. Okay? Where everybody, where all the traffic is, goes through, man. Where all the people go through. She crieth in the chief place of concourse. In the opening of the gates. In the city, she uttereth her voice. Excuse me. In the city, she uttereth her word, saying, How long ye simple ones? Because our people are simple, man. Because they don't know the truth. Of Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai. All right? It's simple, man. Simple minded. You know, they think is the you know, they think the Lord is so called white man. They think America's gonna be here forever. You know? All right. It says, How long ye simple ones will ye love simplicity? And two and two thirds of you so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, you love simplicity, man. You in love with simplicity. You in love with believing in America, man. You know? You in love with believing that the Lord is a so-called white man. You in love with eating pork, shrimp, crab, and lobsters, man. You in love with being wicked. Okay? All right? Committing adultery. Selling, uh, selling drugs, taking drugs, murder. You know? You love to have that, 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 that simple state of mind. Whatever the so-called white man tells you, that's what you just go with. You know? You know, with the magic juice, with the MOTB, you know, voting for the goddamn uh, president. OK, like like the president is going to do something for you so-called Negroes, Latinos and Native Americans. How long have you so-called Negroes, Latinos and Native Americans been here in America, man? And what has happened for you? Nothing but death, bloodshed, murder, desolation, living in the ghettos and the slums. OK. All right. It says, how long ye simple ones will ye love simplicity? And the scorners delight in their scorning, and fools hate knowledge. You know? So, uh, yeah, man. You know? This is, this is supposed to be a way of life. This is how we're supposed to live. All right? Those that are in the know, those that know that they're Israelites. All right? So, you know, it, it seems like a basic scripture, but... It says a lot. You know, this, this is what our state of mind is supposed to be. Okay? Alright, so uh, I hope you brothers have been edified. And with that, Shalom.